Good morning, Grace Life. Good morning, friends, one and all. I just wanted to give you some encouragement this morning. Uh, love. Love is what it's all about. God loves us to the nth degree. We can never know the height, nor the depth, nor the width, nor the breadth of His love. It's constant. It overflows us. The words fail us. We just cannot understand how deeply God loves us, each one of us. I remember as a kid, growing up in my dad's house, my dad used to walk around and say, Praise you, Lord. Praise you, Jesus. Praise you, Father God. Love you, Jesus. Love you, Father. Love you. Love you. Love you. And it was constant. It was, it was a reminder to him. It was a reminder to his family to love God. And my dad, uh, on occasion as a youngster, myself as a youngster, would embarrass me because he would come out with these I love you, Jesus, in the midst of different company. And it would, it would blow my mind. I'd say to myself, what are you doing, Dad? Aren't you, aren't you even uh, scared that people are going to think you're crazy or something? You're talking to nobody. There's nobody that you can't see anybody. But you know, those memories have become precious memories. My dad loved the Lord. And he left a legacy with each one of his five children, with his wife, of how to love God and how to continue, how to be consistent in loving God. And those memories have, have, have not shaken themselves loose, but have produced in me a desire to tell the Lord, I love you, Lord. I love you, Jesus. I love you, God. And it's when we're in that position with God, where we can tell Him, we can be intimate with Him, we're in relationship with Him, when we can understand that He loves us and when we want to tell Him we love Him, and it's a constant thing, we keep on doing it, that our families also pick something up from us. And the thought came to me that I'm, I'm living on, on precious memories that my dad created and left for us. What sort of memories am I leaving for my children to follow? Do they see the love of God in me? Do they see the love of God through me? Do they understand that I love God? This is something that we need to do, and it's something we can do that is it's innocuous. It doesn't take a whole lot of effort, but it does produce a result. It produces a reward that we just cannot calculate. If we can leave a little bit of a deposit of God's love in our children's lives, man, that's, 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 that's really, really something to think about. I thought I would just drop that in there and say, I love Jesus. You declare also that you love Jesus and see what God's love does in your life as it has done in my life. Thank you, folks. Have a lovely day. Be encouraged. Be full of good cheer. Be full of the love of God. Have a lovely one. Amen. Amen.